What's up guys, it's your boy Ryan and Gear Fever. Today we're checking out the Diamond Pedals Compressor. My personal favorite Diamond Pedal, the Compressor, is back. And this time for good. So glad to see this company back on its feet and doing what they do best. This optical compressor has been my go-to for all things acoustic for years, but it's a killer sweetener and evener for all things. It has a level and compressor knob for tone enhancing, and a mids and tilt knob for tone shaping. Plus the attack switch for a more biting tone, this compressor is sure to help smoothen out your sound. The Diamond Pedals Compressor is probably my favorite pedal from the original line of Diamond Pedals. I've owned one for many, many years and it's lived on my acoustic pedal board. Today we're gonna run this compressor through electric stuff, but I really encourage you guys, if you need a really soft and sweet compressor that's easy to use. This is a really, really good one to use. I feel like compressors can be really confusing for a lot of people, and for me it was, but this was the first compressor that I thought I understood how to use. The optical compressor side of it was really helpful and it was really simple and really easy to dial in some tones. And this one has a couple added features that I don't think overcomplicate it. It's still really easy to use. We're gonna check out a few sound samples and see what this compressor sounds like in a track. And then we're gonna twist all the knobs and flip through the switch and see all the sounds that this compressor can make. In this first clip, we're gonna use the compressor as a very mild tone sweetener and you're gonna get to hear it with it bypassed and on so you can see the subtle but important change that the compressor makes here. In this second clip, we're going to highlight the mids knob. I love the addition of the mids knob in this uh, new version of the pedal, and I think what it does is really helps you to sit more forward in the mix. So we've pushed the mids knob all the way to 10. We're also gonna flip the attack switch, and in the up position, it's more transparent and more subtle and a little bit more clear. <laughs> compression knob all the way up and it really evens things out and kind of provides this even dynamic effect to your playing. As always, thank you so much for stopping by the channel. Make sure to check out the other diamond pedal demos that I've done. I've done the entire line except for the bass pedal because I'm not really a bass guy. Uh, but go check those out. There's links uh, down below as well. But please make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment. All of that stuff really helps me out. We're gonna check out all of the tones that this pedal has to offer. So we're gonna plug in, turn all the knobs, flip the switch, uh, and check out all the tones that the diamond pedals compressor has to offer. As always, my name is Ryan. This is Gear Fever. Good tones, good times. Let's do